Alex from uh, uh, Reliance Capital. Our correspondent Alexander Matthew caught up with uh, Sam Ghosh, the EDN Group CEO of Reliance Capital, whose numbers were reasonably impressive. He began by asking him if they are facing any redemption pressures on the mutual fund front. At this point, see, uh, it's too early because normally when there's so much volatility, the customers hold back. However, what has happened is that our net inflows into equities has slowed down mm -hmm. in the first quarter and uh, in the first 20 days. Mm -hmm. But uh, let's wait and see till the end of the month how it looks because it's slowed down by about 20%. Now, again, as I said, it's too early for customers to start reacting very fast. Mm -hmm. So these are, remember, these are retail customers and most of our customers come through systematic investment plans. So therefore, they're giving us monthly figures. It's only the ones who come in who are a bit more aggressive and who have larger amounts of funds to in, 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 uh, put into the uh, asset management company, they're the ones who have slowed down. Mm. Uh, have you changed your outlook for the entire year as far as asset uh, AUM growth is concerned for the full year? Uh, where do you expect to be at the end of the year? No, see, uh, today it's 1,56,000 crores AUM, yes. of which about 51,000 crores is in the equity side. Mm. Now, if you, comp if you look at our debt side, that has about 1 lakh and in that 30,000 is, uh, is liquid. Mm. So liquid more or less if you leave it aside because liquid the fee income is very low. Mm. On the balance, on the on the debt side, that flow continues. Mm. So we haven't had any re reduction in that. On the equity side, as I mentioned, the systematic investment plans also continue. Mm. So therefore we have customers coming to us regularly and I ex expect that they will continue. Mm. So where, so the, well, the only place where we may have a reduction is the customers who are coming in with bulk funds as well as the AUM coming down. So overall for the year, we expect that even at 156,000 today, it should go to about 160 plus. Okay, that's Relcap. A decent set of numbers coming in for that company. By the way, news for LNT.